Mastering Everyday English to get some rest, explained. Hello, everyone. Welcome back to our channel, where we make English easy and fun for you. Today, we're going to unravel the meaning and usage of a very common English phrase, to get some rest. Whether you're a beginner or advancing in English, understanding these everyday phrases can really boost your fluency. So, let's dive in. The phrase, to get some rest, implies taking a break from activities to relax or sleep. It's often used to suggest recovery, especially after being tired, busy, or unwell. For example, if someone says, I need to get some rest, they mean they need to pause and rejuvenate. This phrase is versatile and can be used in various contexts, both formal and informal. Casual conversations. In casual settings, to get some rest is a friendly advice or a way to express concern. For instance, if a friend looks tired, you might say, you look exhausted, you should get some rest. It's a simple yet caring way to show you're thinking about their well-being. Professional scenarios. In a work environment, this phrase might be used more formally. For example, after a long meeting, a colleague might say, that was intense, I think we all deserve to get some rest. It's a polite way to acknowledge hard work and the need for a break. Health and well-being. In healthcare or discussions about health, to get some rest is often prescribed as part of recovery. A doctor might advise, make sure you get plenty of rest to recover faster. Here, rest is seen as essential for healing. There are several variations and synonyms of this phrase, each with a slightly different nuance. For instance, take a break suggests a short pause in activity. Have a rest is more commonly used in British English, similar in meaning. Rest up implies preparing for future activity by resting. Understanding these variations can enrich your conversation skills and help you sound more like a native speaker. I hope this video helps you understand and use the phrase to get some rest confidently in your daily conversations. Remember, learning a language is all about grasping these little nuances. Stay curious, keep learning, and don't forget to get some rest. See you in our next video.